What's up? I missed you this week. Are you ready for a just fast pay, super crazy workout today? I know you are. I don't even have to ask the question. If you're here, I know you're ready to work. Now, I actually procrastinated this workout pretty much all day long. Um, I spent all this week or this past week on a seven day fast. Last night, my wife and I went to a concert. We went and saw one of her favorite artists, and at the concert, I decided to break the fast and have a couple beers. It was a bad idea, so literally, I procrastinated this workout into pretty much the hottest part of the day. It's five o'clock here now, and so I'm sweating already just standing here talking, and I've only been out here for a few minutes, plus I have lights on me, which is adding another, I would say 15 to 20 degrees above that. So it's definitely hot. I've got water, I've been drinking water all day. And another dumb thing, I'm also wearing sweatpants. I don't know why, I grab these and throw them on. And so I'm just gonna be suffering out here. Hard, fast workout, crazy hot, uh, but that's okay. That's the way I like to do things. But before we get started with that, last week I mentioned a fitness challenge. So really quickly, I'm gonna tell you about this specific challenge. One, it's called the seven day fitness battle. I was gonna make it 14 days, I decided to cut it down and do seven, which means I made the challenges just a little bit harder um, overall. So what does the seven day fitness battle exactly entail? So you'll be given a daily fitness or nutrition challenge, kind of like homework or a to-do, um, but a little bit more difficult because a lot of them will take you all day to complete. But you'll have from 5 a.m. to midnight each day that you get your challenge to finish it. And if you procrastinate on any of it, you will not finish it. So even though it's only seven days, it seems short, simple, it's not that easy. So you'll be given a daily fitness or nutrition challenge every day, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. At 5 a.m., it will hit your inbox, your email inbox. You'll have all day to complete it, and then you're gonna report back to a private Facebook group that I'll set up for everybody in the challenge. There may be five of us in the challenge, there may be a hundred of us in the challenge, I do not know. But the Facebook group will be a place where we can keep each other accountable, we can also laugh with each other, um, and see each other's struggles along the way. Now, it doesn't start today, just registration is open this week. So if you wanna peer pressure your friends, to also join in on the insanity of this thing, then you've got all week to do it. It's going to officially start, we're talking the very first challenge, Monday, July 24th, you will get your first challenge for you to do and complete. And it's going to end on July 30th. So if you're ready to rock the seven day fitness battle with myself, I'm gonna be doing it right along with you. Um, I'm not just gonna be typing the stuff out and saying, hey, do this, that seems evil. Um, I'm gonna be doing it with you, right along with you. I like the motivation, I like mixing it up as well. So if it's something you wanna get in on, make sure you click the link below, get signed up for it, and then you're gonna be starting officially with everybody Monday, July 24th. All right, now that that is out of the way, everything's said and my face is sweating and literally my kneecaps are sweating, let's get this incredibly awesome, fat burning, hardcore workout moving right along. Okay, so once you got your water, once you got your dumbbells, listen up. We've got nine exercises. We're gonna be doing them in a Tabata style, which is 20 seconds of work, then you've got 10 seconds to rest, then 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. Now that 20 seconds is just enough time to feel like you're pushing yourself over the top. But it's also not so long that you can't give 120% all the way through. So I want you to push, give everything you got all the way through those 20 seconds, then 10 seconds to kind of catch your breath and chill. We'll do that for six intervals, and then that will be one exercise wrapped up. Then we'll go to the second exercise, We'll do the same thing, 20 seconds of work with 10 seconds of rest for six intervals. I'm gonna be drinking a lot of water because I'm gonna be sweating a lot. I need to put shorts on, but I'm gonna keep my sweatpants on 
and let's just get ready to sweat, supper together, and rock and roll with this thing. Oh, this is gonna suck. Okay, so we're gonna start this with a two minute warm up. We're just gonna loosen up, so let's start with some just jogging in place. We'll do about 10 to 15 seconds of this. There you go. So again, this is just to get the heart rate up, just to get moving. I know the last couple workouts, I really haven't put the warm up in there um, due to whatever reason, but got to get the warm up back in here today. I didn't want to skip it. I think the last time I forgot, and then the time before that, I had my daughter working out with me, and she was pretty much just, I only had her for the moment, so. I didn't want her to get upset and then not do the workout with me. So I skipped that two minutes, so that way I didn't have to sacrifice it. Um, so we're getting it in here today. I'm gonna stop rambling on this. Let's go ahead and take it into jumping jacks. There we go, good, perfect. That's it. Now you're gonna see me sweating like crazy today, okay? Already, already told you all the reasons why. I don't have to re-illustrate that again to you, but it's definitely hot on my end of the camera. So I don't know how you're feeling over there, but hopefully you get a good sweat on as well. If not, go jump in your garage and throw some sweatpants on in the heat of the day. And I'm sure you'll sweat a little bit with me as well. Good. All right, let's keep these moving, jumping jacks. We're gonna speed it up just a little bit here. There we go. Perfect. From these jumping jacks, all we're gonna do is we're gonna go into a squat. There you go, good. All right, so weight on your heels, feet at shoulder width apart. You're gonna take it into a squat, right back up. Very good. Squat and right back up. And I don't know if you can see it on camera. I'm sure you can, but I said my kneecaps were sweating. If I didn't edit that part of the video out when I was uh, announcing some of the stuff before the video. But yeah, if not, look, my kneecaps are sweating, which is crazy. And it's really only my right kneecap, apparently. There we go. I guess my right side sweats more than my left. Who knows? All right, let's keep those squats going. Good. Perfection right there. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, we're gonna pick up pace up a little bit with these. Good, and it will be full body today, okay? It's not gonna be just focused on lower or upper. Since we're doing these workouts on Monday, I think a good full body is always necessary. But it is cardio, okay? High endurance cardio. Perfect. That's it, okay, I want you to take it down. We're gonna do push-ups. Now, I want you to go down. We don't have to go super slow on this or super fast. Just your normal push-up pace, okay? Very good, that's it. We'll do about 15 seconds on this. We're gonna finish back up with some butt kicks. Just our normal warm-up cardio routine. And then we'll start the actual workout itself. All right, three more, two more. One more, back up. All right, so let's take it into butt kicks on this one. This will be the last thing we have for our warm up here. If you want more, then make sure you pause the workout. You can do a few more exercises. Nothing overly strenuous, but you can always add more into the warm up yourself if you want to. That's it. Very good, perfect. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be breathing today. You're gonna, you're gonna hear this old man huffing and puffing right here. Okay. In three, two, one. Okay, so Tabata style, I've got my timer set. I've got dumbbells, like I said, the first exercise. You will need weight, okay? I'm gonna show you the exercise. So this one, what we're gonna be doing is a clean, a clean with a squat jump, okay? You may have heard of a clean and press, it's similar. So for this one, you start low, you power the weight up to your shoulders, and then you squat, and you jump with the dumbbells. Okay, so first exercise right off the bat. It's gonna suck. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm gonna start this timer in 10, nine, oh man, eight, I'm dreading it, seven, six, five. I'm using 20 pounds for this. I have 30s to step up into if I don't die on the first few sets. In three, two, one. All right, here we go. So squat down, power the weight up to your shoulders, squat and press. Right back down, power it up to your shoulders, squat and press. Good, that's it, and jump. All right, here we go. Let's bring it up and jump. Good. All right, 10 seconds. So 
I'm gonna go with the 30s. To really get good form out of this, you need heavier weights. All right, so start at the ground, bring them up, squat and jump, that's it, good. So weight to the shoulder, squat and jump, very good. So bring the weight to the shoulders, squat and jump, perfect. All right, here we go, come on. Good, okay, keep it up, we've got four more sets of these right here, here we go. All right, so power them up to your shoulders, squat, jump, good. You may be going faster on this, depending the weight you're using. I'm doing good not to have a heart attack with this weight. Oh, come on, man. Come on. All right, catch your breath. 10 seconds, going back into it. Five seconds. All right, here we go. Bring it up and boom, jump. Good, so bring it up and jump. Oh, perfect. Bring that weight up and jump. Good. All right, I'm probably gonna get delusional during this workout. This is gonna be tough. So, everything I say may not make sense in a minute. Here we go. Bring it up, squat, and jump. Good. And here we go, bring the weight up, squat, and jump. Excellent. Bring that weight up, squat, and jump. Two. All right, we got one more, I believe. Then we get to rest for 30 seconds. Okay. Here we go. And up, and jump. Good. Way back down, bring it up, and jump. Come on, get that weight up, and jump. Ooh. Come on, and bring that weight up, and jump. Okay, 30 seconds, catch your breath. Ooh. Okay, get some water. We got 30 seconds, a little less in. Next, what we're gonna be doing, is plank jacks with a push-up. So we'll actually do four plank jacks and then we'll do one push-up. You'll see when we get down to it, but you will be on the ground, okay, in the push-up position. All right, whew, here we go. So for this one, you're gonna go one, two, three, four, and push-up. One, two, three, four, push-up. One, two, three, four, push up. That's it. So like doing a jumping jack, but in a push up position. Good. And with our push ups, keep your hands about shoulder width apart on them, okay? All right, five seconds. Ten. Here we go. One, two, three, four, push up. One, two, three, four, push up. Good. Two, three, four, push up. Almost there. Two, three, four. Ooh. All right, we got four sets left. Four sets. Keep breathing, doing good. It's not gonna get any easier from here. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four. Push up, remember, keep that butt down. One, two, three, four. Push up. One, two, three, four. Get that push up in there. One, two, three, four. Ugh. 10 seconds, doing fantastic. Okay, keep it going. Keep your butt down just like if you were in a plank. All right, here we go. One, two, three. Get that four reps with the push up. One, two, three, four. And you can modify the push-up if you need to. Two, three, four. Ooh. One, two, three, four. Ooh. Excellent, relax, 10 seconds. Now I know one of you saw me at the concert last night. 
Whoever that was, comment below. I'm really curious. One, two, three, four. Get that push up. There we go. One, two, three, four. Oh, almost there. One, two, three, four. Ooh, I know my butt's getting a little high in here. I can tell. Oh. So, when you start getting sloppy, really pay attention to that so you can correct it. It may not be perfect, but you can, you can focus on it. Here we go. One, two, three, four. And actually, when you're a straight body with this one, doing these plank jacks, you'll feel it in your hamstrings. Your hamstrings will lock out to stabilize. Good. Keep it up. All right, 30 seconds. I was in, that was quick. So now is a di diagonal mountain climber kick out. So this one, you're gonna bring a knee in, kick straight back out. We're gonna do 20 seconds on one leg, 20 seconds on the other, okay? Versus alternating back and forth. Again, get some water if you need it. I'm gonna stretch out, let my legs get some blood flow. Oh man, doing good. Doing really good. Two, one. Okay, so I'm taking my left, Knee into my right elbow. Left knee, right elbow, kick it straight back. Now this one is good cardio, but it's also really good for the abs. And it puts that burn back in those shoulders. And we just got done burning. Okay, switching to the other leg now. Whew. All right. Okay, here we go. So, knee, kick back. Knee in, kick back. This time it's my right knee to my left elbow. Kick him back. Perfect. That's it. Come on. Keep those kickbacks going. Almost there. Feeling it. I'm feeling it for sure. Move this stuff up. Do a head on with you here. Here we go. So now, left knee. Kick back, there's a wall behind me. So, I'm gonna have to bend my knee a little bit here, or kick out farther to the side. Good. Back to the left knee, right elbow. Good. Whew, I'm feeling this one. And relax, good. I think my sweat's evaporating before it actually hits the ground. Because I should have a puddle down here. So far. All right, right knee. Left elbow, kick back. Right knee. Left elbow, kick back. Good. Kick him back. Almost there. Perfect. Oh, oh man, we're there. We're doing this. Three, two, one. Relax. Last 10 seconds. Okay. Doing good. Going back to that opposite leg now. We're halfway, a little over halfway. Two more of them. Okay. Let's go. I'm gonna position myself out so I don't have to worry about kicking the wall behind me. Making a lot of noise. Good. Really bring that knee in. I know when you get tired, you'll shorten it. But really try to crunch it in. Three, two, one. Relax. Okay, 10 seconds. Last one on this one. Here we go. Three, two, two one. one. All right, here we go. Oh, two, three, four. Keep it going. Let's see how many we can get. Five, six, seven. Last one. Eight. Come on. Nine. Ten. Oh. All right, 30 seconds. Thank goodness. Now, we're doing a squat thrust on this one. This is where your feet come in and right back out. If you're worried about your shirt riding up, tuck it in right now. But we're gonna do feet wide when we kick them out, and then feet narrow when we kick them out. Alternating between the two, it'll hit our abs a little bit differently when we switch those positions like that. But we wanna go fast, so we keep the heart rate up. All right, here we go. So, feet in, back out wide. Feet in, back out close. In, out. Back and forth, just like that. This one's pretty simple. Definitely not a complicated move but it's not easy as far as physical goes. Good.
Come on, we got this. Catch your breath. All right. Five more sets. I should have drank some water on that last one. Ah, good habit to get into. All right, here we go. Come out, back in. Now, it doesn't matter if you start kicking your feet out wide at first or narrow, just make sure you alternate. Good. Keep that pace up. Almost there. Come on, we got this. Like I said, that 20 seconds is just enough to feel like you're dying. Even though you're not. Oh, you're gonna hate me on the next one. Ah. All right, come on, let's go. Good, but that 10 seconds of rest or transition definitely isn't a lot of time to be resting. Not even enough to really get water, unless you want it to cut into the workout. Ah. Okay, I've lost count what we're on. I think that's three in. Yeah, so three more. Okay, two, one. Here we go, keep them out. Doing good, here we go. Come on, keep working. Keep working, keep working, keep working. Doing good on this. I'm definitely hurting, I can feel it. Ooh. 10 seconds. I haven't even eaten anything in a few hours and I can still feel it. I think it was from my dumb choices last night though. I think that's the reason I'm hurting more than anything. Who knows? We did have fun though. We love going to concerts. So, almost there. Come on, we can do this. Two, one. For the last 10 seconds we got one or two more. How would you get your hopes up though? So let's say two. Three, two, one. Exercise four. Here we go. One, two. Remember, feet wide, feet narrow. Feet wide, feet narrow. Kick them out, kick them in. There we go. Come on. Five seconds. Thirty seconds. Catch your breath. Okay, so for this one, make sure you got a little bit of room. We're gonna be doing some jumping. Okay. So for this one, it's gonna be a burpee, but instead of just jumping up, we're gonna be jumping from side to side. Okay. So again, I'm getting some water. We got eight seconds. Ah, I just want to dump it on myself. Okay, so burpees. Here we go. So down, you're gonna do a full push up, back up, and jump to the side. Down, full push up, back up, jump to the side. Down. If you want to add a challenge, I used to do this with a yoga mat in the middle. You can do the same thing. You can put something and make you jump over it. So that way you're getting your feet up. Okay. Keep breathing. It's getting harder and harder to do. All right, here we go. Sit down, full push up. That's one burpee. Come on, keep moving with me. I can promise it's hot in here where I'm at. I'm burning up. That's two. That's three. Here we go. That's it. All right, I got four on that. Okay, seven seconds. Starting back. All right, let's do this. Sit down. Keep that push up. Back. Here we go. Down. So what's the temperature like where you're at? I know some of you are watching this from all over the world. Do you got nice tips? It's nice and cool? Because I'm jealous. If you do. Huh. Seven seconds, that's three down. Three more on this exercise. Three, two, one. All right, let's go. Okay, now, if you start getting too hot though, you know, listen to your body. Don't make yourself have a heat stroke or heat exhaustion. That's not worth it, super dangerous, okay? Believe me, if I stop sweating, I will stop working out. Hey, catch your breath, nine seconds. 
<sighs> Whoo! Cold Three, water. Two. Not too cold though. Exercise five. Alright, here we go. Down. Get that push up. Back up, burpee. Jump over. You can also do a tuck jump with it. And if you really want to get those knees up, good. I'm doing good. Just get my feet off the ground. And get a couple reps in. Okay, 10 seconds. Ah, oh, we're doing good. We're doing really good here. I know it's exhausting, but. All right, here we go. Down. Oh, definitely. This one's slow. Ah, down. Hopefully you're moving a little bit faster than I am this round. This one's pretty sloppy, I will admit. Ooh. 30 seconds. Catch your breath. Okay, so let's catch your breath. Okay, so I will admit, I ran in the house really quick, grabbed the water, came back out. So if you want to pause the workout for a few seconds, get a few extra seconds of rest, go for it. If not, we're going to continue on because my camera just gave me a warning that it's getting too hot and I don't want to break my camera. So we're going to continue on. The next one is going to be a low burpee with a reverse slide. You will need some weight. So for this one, you're going to go down into a burpee. You're going to do a push up as a full burpee, back up with your dumbbells, reverse fly, okay? You won't get a whole lot of reps on this due to the reverse fly movement, but I want you to at least try to get three or four out of the way. All right, 10 seconds, catch your breath. Doing good. All right, five seconds, two, one, here we go. So down, push it, back up, and reverse fly, that's it. Down, push up, back up, reverse fly. Down, push up, back up, and reverse fly. Almost there. Five seconds. Good. Do it perfect. Eight seconds. Okay, two down, four more to go on this one. Three. Here we go. I heard some beeping coming from in the house. I thought it was my camera. I was like, that's not good. All right. Keep working. Oh, excellent. Eight seconds. We're almost there. Come on. All right, catch your breath. 10 seconds, three down, three more. Here we go, come on. Back up. Now I know back to back burpees. It's definitely not easy, but it's necessary. Good. Come on. Ah, two. Two more. Two more. Ah, doing good. You're doing good, camera. You're doing good. I'm suffering, but doing good. Here we go. Down, push up, back up, get those flies, here we go, back up, get those flies, excellent, I definitely say it's not easy, but well worth it, <sighs> Whew, probably burn a couple pounds of fat just for this workout alone, <sighs> four seconds, two, one, Come on, this should be the last one here. Then we've got a couple exercises left. That's it. Come on, we can do this. Five seconds. Okay, next one, make sure there's no slick spots around. You're gonna be jumping. I'm actually gonna sit down for this one, explain it. We're gonna jump forward and we're gonna run backwards. That's all there is to it. So there's a sleek spot around. Make sure you miss it or you'll bust your head. And you don't want that. Not good. All right, I've got a little bit of a slick spot here. But, so jump forward, hustle back. Now, I'm definitely pretty drained to this point right here. So, I want you though, 
So really jump as far forward as you can. Hustle back as fast as you can. Two, one. Let me check my camera real quick. All right. It's definitely getting hot. Five seconds. Ten. Here we go. Pushing back. All right. That's it. Jump forward. Pushing back. Here we go. Pushing back. So if it cuts off accidentally, that's the reason why. I think we'll make it though. It can handle quite a bit of heat. Ah. I don't know if I can, but he can. All right. Like I said, no slip spots. I just made a huge one. All right. Forward leap, hustle back. Forward leap, hustle back. Good. Forward jump, hustle back. Five seconds. Uh, ten seconds. Come on. Whew. We're gonna get thuggy in here. Pant legs up now. Just got real. All right. Forward, hustle back. Uh, it's more turned into a, a jump with a walk. Uh, that's it. Perfect. That's how you know this is real workout with you. Cause I'm hurting. Uh, there's no pausing and making these pretty. Okay, five seconds. Come on, you got this right here. Right here. Okay, I can do this, Ben. Come on, I need that pep talk. Cheer me on, guys, cheer me on. Ooh, my body's wanting to stop. My mind says you can do it, but my body's saying, uh-uh. Shouldn't have drank that beer last night, Ben. Ooh. Hey, catch your breath. 10 seconds, we got one more. One more. That's it. All right. And forward, push it back. Forward, push it back. Come on. Forward, push it back. Whether you're walking, running, leaping, maybe you're laying there. I know I want to. All right, catch your breath. Whoo, so catch your breath. Okay, we got one more, one more. We were gonna do nine exercises all together, but the last one was literally just a one minute plank. I'm gonna cut that one out. So one, I don't damage my camera being too hot, and I don't pass out from being too hot either. So I'm still sweating, but I can definitely tell that it's getting harder for my body to produce all sweat. So last one, you'll need your dumbbell, okay? It's gonna be a squat press, best for last. And here we go. So squat down low, press the weight overhead, okay? Now, I was originally gonna use the two 30 pound dumbbells for this, but I'm gonna do, be good to get through with the 20 pound dumbbells. So, here we go, let's rock. Let's keep it up, no stopping, keep pushing. Hey, catch your breath. All right, 10 seconds. Almost there, almost there, four seconds. And if you do have to do this without weight, Okay, just use body weight, but I still want you to throw your hands up in the air as if you were using weight, okay? Whew, this feels like 150 pounds. I have a feeling I may be pretty worthless after this workout. All right. <sighs> 10 seconds. <sighs> this one's hurting. Okay, I'm gonna do a modified one on this one. So like I said, squat. Still throw your hands up. So squat, still throw your hands up. Whew. There we go, keep working. That's it, that's it. Come on, we got this. I'm just gonna pretend that this is a cold ice cave. Hey, catch your breath. Whew. I think I have imagination big enough to pretend that. Three more. And here we go. One, come on, two, and three, that's it, and four, ah, almost there, five, 
Normally I would average probably about 15 reps on this. So, I'm only getting about five. I'm modifying this one again. So squat, hands up if you're not using weight. Squat, still throwing your hands up. Your arms do weigh something. Here we go. Perfect. Come on. Six seconds. Here. Catch your breath. One more. I think this is the last one. I'm gonna be bummed if it's not. Again, I'm doing modified so I don't pass out. Here we go. Two. So if you're seeing this for the first time, well, I'm, I apologize for looking totally weak, but I'd rather keep myself safe than totally injure myself. So that way I can continue on working out till I'm 90 or 100 years old. Okay. All right. That was it. That was it right there. So I'm gonna stop this. Like I said, if you wanna do the very last exercise and you're not in 120 degrees, then the last one was a one minute plank. Okay, so not the Tabata, just a front plank on your forearms. I will save it for myself for later. Right now, I'm gonna catch my breath and cool down and get out of this hot, hot atmosphere. All right, I love you guys. I'm so appreciative of you suffering with me and being here today. Again, like I said in the beginning of the workout, if you want to join me on the seven day fitness battle, make sure you click the link below so you can register and get set up for that. And I'll add you to the private Facebook group and we can kind of hang out, get to be better friends from there on out. All right. I love you guys. I will see you next Monday for another awesome Fit Body Nation workout, guys. Whew.